You know what rhymes with wisely spent cash? See me, I'd go with a high-speed jetpack. <laughs> Frank was leaning more towards a Chinese neck tag. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd he get that? Yo, we are here at Code Red Culture Launch Coast, the first event we're about to get into one of the main events. So please, if you're in concrete space, make some noise! So on my right hand side, making his long time return, a legend, a vet, the, the guy. Please make some noise for Quill, let's go! I'll take that, I'll take that, good intro. If you don't know who this guy is, where have you fucking been hiding? He's the absolute man. Make some noise for Bobby Wiggins! Ah! Pressure! None of it! Don't feel it. You're mad. I was born with Chief. I'll kill it. I was born with Chief. Eating chips on the day of birth. You're mad. Born to do this. Yo, yo. This is, because it's short prep, this is a one rounder. So. One round on Quill, let's go. Yo, we all awake? Yeah. yeah! Some of you, okay. So apparently, Tony D's not your uncle. <laughs> I guess that's why you never were at the birthdays. But, <laughs> but, thank, but thanks to me, you got to make it at the birthplace. So let's start by giving you some advice. Look, if you get a last minute battle, you need to stumble and choke like everyone else does because if you absolutely smash it Bobby, trust me, it's not going to help cuz. I mean nowadays I don't even get my name on the flyer for the events. I mean I just turn up to hear some fire and to vibe with all my friends and Danny's like Quill, you know you're my favourite and you're writing as the best cut of crap. Who's dropped out and who am I headlining against? <laughs> As soon as I got the green light to plan his funeral, I got my shit together so quick. You think I received a booty call? Yeah, you wouldn't choke at Q if you were to receive a fucking. You wouldn't choke at Q if you were to put a snooker ball. Hot headed, I'ma lose my cool if you don't know your material. Cause you've been smoking spliff out the previous night, doing loads of sniff. We know Bobby. He began overly pissed with his mates next day. Doesn't know the script. Partying late on some Wobby tip. Let's go, Bob. <laughs> What comes out my mouth in the game like the golden snitch against Oshua shit? <laughs> against Oshua shit, your drinking's out of control. He said I haven't battled sober, maybe you should battle alcohol. I mean, I get it. I mean, I get it. You're the creative type. We don't use guns on opponents like they do. That's a Bruce Wayne move, but after a couple of great goose, I'm ready to scoff quicker than suede shoes. Fuck mm. if you're bigger. Fuck if you're bigger. I am not scared, cause if tempers flare up, oh. Oh, fuck it, you look big when you did that. <laughs> Up his chest, I am still not scared. Cause if tempers flare up, I'll tie up Bob like a Bellerin haircut. Oh. Oh. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you gave your best performance against Tony. Still got killed by Tony like Christopher from the Sopranos when he's holding his nose after the car rolls. Against press one, we realized you was racist then. He doesn't give a monkeys. HM. <laughs> You even rang your friend to get your bars in the battle. That's got to be the lowest point. Or when it came to your golden moment, you couldn't own it. You let it pass against Osh when you folded and were choking on your bars. Or King of the Ronalds performing in front of two people, smoking in the bar. Park, in the bar, in the park. You even fucking choked against innuendo. Or did he choke against you? I couldn't tell you both apart. I mean, listen, listen. 
<laughs> you clearly haven't grown. My man's won best newcomer three years in a row. <laughs> I went to King of the Dot. You lot supported me for both my appearances. You went to King of the Dot. Why is this the first time we're hearing this? You know I mean? <laughs> you didn't promote him. You ain't making money off your name, even though you named after Guap after battling me. You might make a few bob. Still ain't getting paid. That's tragic. I'm getting money from it. Same as Magic Boss. I like he ain't catch it. Trying to hide that it goes like James St. Patrick. Ooh. Fuck. Ooh. Yeah. Fuck all this mic shit. What do you know about us London guys who creep in your yard while you tucked in at night as cool as a cucumber? Then take those bags from under your eyes. Fuck with me. This motherfucker tried, you tried to enter the two on two tournament with your daughter. <laughs> that sort of works, I guess. Phoebe's a spitting image, like Ursula from Friends. I mean, Every day after school, he teach her how to rap. She's so lucky, her big daddy taught his kid how to spit and she had to suck it up. I mean, oh, woo! Oh, fuck off! Why did you pat his back? He pat his back, he pat his back because I'm fire and he is whack. Yo, your daughter's not joining the choir, y'all. Your daughter's not joining the choir, y'all. She'd be in a playground corner forming a cypher, spitting a favorite Lord and a Might Bob. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even kidding, it's fucked up. Master, who's the best in the scene? She told my man, shut up. <laughs> you wanted to cement your name in this battling shit. Ended up getting buried in concrete like a mafia hit. I mean, I mean you made your name from Revival. You made his name from Revival. It's a shame you couldn't live up to the title. I mean, I told her I would headline for free when he does something next. Because when Don't Flop was flatlining, I was there pumping on his chest. You couldn't wait for it to sink before you jump shit, Rex. I mean, chalked out, Cold Red. You even on shot his new league, cuz. But I wouldn't expect to see his stuff. His team's got Frankie Wan and Cole J. I guess you must be the sub. It's calm. It's calm. It's calm. Play all four. It's calm. Play all. I guess you must be the sub. Play all four. I'll dispose of you easily enough. Panic and put the corpse in the bath. It's easier to clean up the blood. Who's Bob Slay and I'm cool running? I have the whole team in the top. Yo! If I smell something fishy, I cut him the calamari. I make his team split like a statement from Callum Martin. I swear. <laughs> I mean, that's too soon. I knew this man was a traitor. As soon as you sold out, dank Schrader. I mean, <laughs> I mean, you sold out your best friend as a pedo. To, but you know what? You won best newcomer of 2016, though. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, yes, I, <laughs> I mean, he apparently he was a 20-year-old banging a 15-year-old. Thanks to you, that's the facts that we know. But now for not paying the price, he. Getting exposed now, Bobby Valentino. Fuck oh, yes. <laughs> it, nearly, nearly, nearly. <laughs> Danny, yes, sir. it's easy to make a league, yeah. it's just harder to make the tea. <laughs> <laughs> Are you not ready to adapt? Are you ready to adapt? <laughs> End of round one, man is feeling hella strong, I ain't going anywhere. Danny, put the kettle on! Right, yo, yo, chill, chill, chill. <laughs> <laughs> yo, I ain't got a mic, innit? <laughs> yeah, the mic, I can whistle. I am actually whistling when I do this. <laughs> yeah, dickhead, I can whistle too. <laughs> Yeah, dickhead, I can whistle too. It isn't new. Pick a tune, I'll whistle it. <laughs> no, I'm saying, check this out. It's another little trick I do. Now, because I don't spit as many punchlines, similes, and metaphors, they'll go online and said they saw me lose today. But while I'm here, if you're one of them guys, please allow me to explain. You're gonna have to work with me on this one though, yeah? <laughs> Use your brain. <laughs> Think about it. If he does punchlines, similes, and metaphors, and he does punchlines, similes, and metaphors, and he does them in the exact same format that they've just been said before, then why the fuck would I do the same? <laughs>
Is it not bad enough that this room's the same? Uh. There's Danny Jack, Bagnall, Briggs there. <laughs> the crew's the same. Even the fucking crowd. You, 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 the same. We need something different. Expect for now the game is in such a crucial stage and we've got our leagues, leagues fighting to find out who will reign, putting these spectacular cards together and booking the hugest names. And have you noticed there's one person who's on every single fucking one of them cards? <laughs> a person who last year flew on planes to different continents and countries exploring new terrains and not once did he sacrifice his own style to try and suit the tastes of those that was watching in the room or those who viewed the tapes later on pay-per-view or those who waited until the YouTube date was due. And he cussed you out and he cussed you out online making the rudest statements but to your face it's all dude. You was great, I knew you'd waste him. <laughs> <laughs> to your face, it's all, dude, you was great, I knew you'd waste him. Everything you do is amazing. Who you facing next? I bet that dude is shaking in his boots already because you proved today that even if a guy's pen's ill, you'll erase him. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. That's, yeah. Why they, that's why they book you on every card, bro, because they know that you will help to boost the ratings and I think that deserves some fucking credit. So for Canel, can we please give a round of applause? <laughs> Can we please give a round of applause and a huge ovation? Yeah. I am fucking yeah. A. I am fucking right, A. Right, 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 Me, I am fucking A. But honestly though, real shit. Even the moves he's making are putting you to shame. Didn't you spit two rounds last year? Two rounds, mate. <laughs> One mission. Do the favour, fuck off. How dare you stand strutting around in front of me like you're one of the guys that rule the game. I'm Bobby fucking Ras Clark Rex. How dare you stand in front of me strutting around like you rule the game. I'm Bobby Ras Clark fucking Rex. This rap shit is running through the veins. You're just any regular guy that's clever with rhymes. Turns up every six months when he's skint to fucking boost his wage. <laughs> South Africa, Canada, they're places you've already gone. I've even think that you was once flown over to America. You don't go there anymore though, do you? Because no. <laughs> as it's looking right now, don't flop, is dead and gone. And back in the day, when everything was running smooth and everyone was still getting on, you was getting helped out and pushed by air because you and him, you have a special bond. <laughs> <laughs> you even shout him out in your slogan when you say, yo, air, uh, put, put a can on! And all of us are like, as if he's ever made a brief for anyone. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it's, it's time to let go of the past G. The new slogan we're upholding is Cold Red or oh, Fucking oh, Dead! And that's what I'm screaming at him if they ask me. But it's still a bit weird that if you take the letters of his name, divide them up and subtract T, it looks like Danny Jack has named his league after Craft D! <laughs> and for that alone, I wish he was fucking ginger right now. <laughs> Because I swear you'd be getting executed. Ginger virgin poet style. I wouldn't even need to get off my neck, yo. You, you'd be getting executed. Ginger virgin poet style. I wouldn't even need to get off my neck to do it. I'd just fucking do it anyway. As a little bit of extra proof, I don't even give a fuck about this battle. I'm just doing this shit to show more some re disrespect to him. Ah, oh, don't let me forget it. <laughs> to show some more disrespect to him. What was just before that? Tell me, quickly. Ah, oh, yeah. To show some disrespect to him. But <coughs> show some. Oh. I wish that you was ginger for this. Because I swear that you'd be getting executed, ginger virgin poet style. Ah, I'm one of the best to do it. Let me move on. What happens after that? <laughs> I won't get off my neck to do it. I won't get off my neck to do it. <laughs> if you're running out of patience, I can freestyle while he's waiting. Man, Man can't freestyle while I'm waiting. It's my bars they're anticipating. <laughs> 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 
Oh yeah, so listen, you all think this is a big battle for me. It's not. I actually found it uninspiring. So every bar I just spat, I wrote it last night while I was reading about Michael Carrick. He's just announced his retirement. <laughs> Sky Sports News. If you don't believe me and you need to research that, there was also a story yesterday, Ross Barkley saying, I want to be world class. <laughs> CNN reported Vladimir Putin took a dip in a freezing cold pool as a mark for the Ukraine. I thought that was pretty normal for Russians. I thought that's the way that they preferred baths. <laughs> See, this battle shit is not that important. It isn't a matter of life or death. I don't need to go looking deep inside a guy's real lives. You know what I'm saying? The most I've ever searched one of my opponent's names is once or twice at best and he's even on Facebook. I searched his name, couldn't find the threads. Same as Twitter, went on there, tried to find it, tried my best. <laughs> All I had was a couple of posts from Instagram from time to time. That's what I had to try to prep. <laughs> Fuck's sake. You know what, looking, at, <laughs> looking, looking into this guy's life had me quite depressed. There's absolutely nothing to him. He is playing his shit. He posted a video, New Year's Day of him, about two o'clock in the morning, <laughs> running through the streets. Like, what do you know about running five miles, <laughs> eating healthy and staying fit? <laughs> what do you know about running five miles, eating healthy and staying fit? To be honest, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I know absolutely nothing about that. <laughs> New Year's Eve. <laughs> I'm out with friends and family celebrating it. Why are you not doing the same you did? <laughs> Talking about I ain't going anywhere. Yes, you are. Alone, home, on the train, because you ain't got any fucking mates, you prick. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hell, the guy's best off playing dead like ATM. What can you actually Ooh. say? Ooh. What can he actually say to me? Your All fat right, got a pot belly. What can they say? The devil's led me to the toffees like Wayne Rooney. <laughs> 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 End of round one. Quill ain't as sick as me. I don't need you to put the kettle on any word. I already finished tea. <laughs> I'm the uncle! <laughs> Time! <laughs>